In this release, we've improved our Google test support and added another often requested integration with CTest. But starting with Google test, the first thing to note is that the tree view is now created ahead of time and then populated with results as they run. So you get a better idea of progress, especially during longer running tests. If you have parameterized tests, you'll now see the values passed in as parameters right in the tree. And disabled tests are now shown in the tree view too, with an icon to show that they're disabled. And if a branch contains only some disabled tests, you'll see that as an icon overlay on the branch. Well, we heard you like test runners, so we made a test runner for your test runner. We've now integrated with CTest. CTest is itself a test runner, so this was a bit more complicated than it sounds. Well, let's see it in action by using it to run the test suite for Catch2. This suite has a mix of Catch2 unit tests, some command line checks, and a set of Python scripts that run the Catch self-test executable with different command lines and then diff them against previous runs, a form of approval testing. Because the Catch2 CMake project uses CTest to invoke all of these different types of tests, they just work in CLine. Here we see a failure in the approval tests due to a formatting change. We can drop to the terminal and run the script to approve that change, then go back and ask CLine to rerun just the failed tests. And now it passes. The run config for CTest used here was created automatically when CLine detected the use of CTest in the CMake list file. It's even detected the list of tests to run, and we can be more selective using this GUI. We can also run the tests in parallel by passing this option as a CTest command line argument. And you can even debug into your tests. CLine is smart enough to debug the test process rather than the CTest process that it actually launches. CLine also supports analyzers, like Valgrin Memcheck and the Google Sanitizers, as well as profilers and code coverage tools when running through CTest, although in this case it does include the CTest process. There are a few limitations to CTest support for now. Do read the blog post for more details. So, with improvements to our Google test support, a new integration with CTest, we continue to make the testing experience in CLine more powerful and easier to use.